Hey Gemini, so welcome to your reading. Guys, hopefully y'all know the drill. <laughs> this reading should only give you confirmations of the things you already intuitively know and sense about your person and your connection. If you're not getting confirmation and it does not resonate for you, check out your other sign positions, your sun, moon, rising, or Venus. Sometimes when it comes to uh, relationship and partnerships, the signs in your 7th or 8th house may resonate. And if you're having a love affair, the sign in your 5th house may be the one that would resonate for you. Let's jump in. Let's see if I can get you some kind of confirmation so you'll know are these messages for you. See, first person in the connections energy. We've got a judgment, a resurrection. Yeah. Wanting to bring something back to life, coming back to life. Let's clarify on this person's energy. What's been reawakened for them? The judgment. How priestess. Ooh, guys. Mm. I like it. I like seeing that one. Uh, that one is, uh, it's almost like saying I've had a deep, deep awakening about our connection. Mm -hmm. Intuitive connection. Let's see the other side of the energy, other person in the connection. Their energy. Oh, we've got a wheel of fortune. Wheel of fortune. Mm hmm Okay, let's clarify on their energy. Wheel of Fortune. Clarify that wheel. I like the fact it's upright. Everybody else's readings, I was getting a lot of reversals. Ooh, a Nine of Wands. Battle Weary. With the Nine of Wands, a lot of times uh, you'll be in the energy of asking yourself, am I wasting my time trying to change something that can't be changed bottom of the deck we got the hermit eh. hermit is in introspection guys but it is showing that we've been quiet between each other for a little while whether that's in separation or whatever we've just pulled been pulled away doing um a lot of introspection diving deep on our thoughts our, our feelings about the connection and where it's headed got the moon card yeah We've had a lot of silence between us. Uh, first person over here, like I said, they in in that silence, their high priestess, their intuition, the deeper truth of their self, their true feelings have awakened. Over here, we've got someone wondering if it's just a karmic <laughs> kind of relationship, the ups and downs, and and feeling battle weary, like you know, I've been beat up through this. Can can things change for for us um but think of this person feels like there's a pattern going on and it's over and over they're battle weary this person's woke up to something and we've got two major arcanas over here this person is serious whatever the shift is that's took place the moon let's see what's up under the moon Communications will be coming back open for us uh, to talk about what what we've gotten from this introspection. Uh, think of more a calmer way of communicating, a serious. And we have the hair font, faith. Faith. And you all know a lot of times a hair font will show up when it's, you know, a divine connection that we have that could be soulmate twin flame or you know just just you are my person for this life yeah i can't get past it so yeah gemini hopefully that was enough to give you confirmations is this your reading or not like i said communications do seem to be on on the path to opening up and i'm talking like deeper honest calm we're hearing each other. We're listening to each other and not being triggered by each other. It's more of an authentic, from the heart kind of talk. Mm -hmm. See what deck your person is going to put energy down on. Ew, we're getting this one, guys. Let's get it shuffled up. Get the energy on it. It's for my Gemini's. I'm going to split the deck in half, make it easier on my hands, guys. This is for my Geminis, my Geminis. Talk to us. 
Why do I feel like I need to take them? They felt like they fell out. Uh, but I feel like we need to take them. It's hard for me to have faith that we are each other's forever person. Mm -hmm. I'm battle weary. My true foundation is, was with you. I owe you so much. Come back to me, please. You don't see the truth. The silence is too much for me. It feels like I am nothing more than your current favorite flavor. I need to be released from the torture of this. I don't want to feel like I'm replaceable. I want the ability to show vulnerability. Fell for the pyrite fool's gold. I can't handle these emotions. I can't think straight right now. Second guessing everything. I'll be forever lonely without you. No relationship is easy. Truth is in the facts. Mm. I always knew the truth. Feeding the fire of desires. Your words broke me. Switch sides here. Gemini's, Gemini's. I still love you. I'm so conflicted and exhausted. No way, shape, or form could I ever measure up. In pursuit of the party lifestyle. I held back because I didn't want to allow my brain to trick me into believing attraction is love. Trying to cope. It's not a fair chance when you don't speak up and tell me what it is that you need and want. Confirmation for someone, Aquarius, January and February. Pay attention to the months also. They might be trying to point out something about the months. How did you know? I feel like I'm running out of time. I want your transparency. I don't want to love you as much as I do. Gemini's, I hope it was helpful, guys. Y'all stay blessed.